in today's video i will be doing the mermaid challenge but before we do this let's get into the shout out i love you guys so much thank you so much for the comments but without further ado let's get into the video like i said i am going to be doing the mermaid challenge in today's video so this is the drawing the process just trust the process guys because um it might have looked a bit questionable at the start but i promise it will look better at the end and i used references a lot not a lot but a lot okay um because i haven't done side profile stuff before see i only i've only done like front facing ones you know um and i found it kind of hard but you know it's my first try so don't be harsh okay don't be harsh anyway um of course i slayed the eyebrows i mean we all know we all know i did that okay i also wanted to say that this video is inspired by christina Larey. um i absolutely love her channel if you guys don't know her i will literally put her like a screenshot of the channel um right now i literally love her so much um you should definitely go check out her videos and um, this was inspired by her she did the mermaid challenge like one week ago which is so crazy um she's such a huge inspiration to so many people and yeah i just wanted to pop in and say that the actual crazy thing is that i attempted the mermaid challenge um last year 2020 yeah um but i didn't post it on my youtube i wasn't very consistent then and stuff like that but i actually did attempt it and <laughs> i'm just gonna say this guys it's, it's um very different to this one <laughs> but um yeah this one's definitely better but if you guys want to see the end result sail till the end and of course don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and if you have turn on your post notifications okay yeah subscribe to my channel i promise you won't regret it and it's free okay it's free don't, no no fee okay just press the it literally won't even take any energy just press it yeah yeah thank you And as you can see again, I was using reference for the ears. Um, I used a lot of reference in this. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I did. But I think it was a good thing because it turned out really nice. And, and, <clears throat> if you don't know about this, I don't know where you've been because I've literally been saying it since, but something exciting is coming up and if I was you, I wouldn't want to miss out on it, so, turn on your post notifications, yeah, yeah, do it, yay, um, but yeah, there's something very exciting coming up in the next few, well, kind of months, but kind of not, okay? Um, I don't really want to tell you guys what it is because obviously I don't want to ruin the surprise for y'all. But yeah, very excited. Um, once you guys obviously get to witness the surprise, see it. Y'all are gonna be shocked. Um, but yeah. But yeah, y'all, this girl is so cute. Oh my gosh. Um, I'm absolutely in love with her hair. Um, um, I decided to give her a unique hairstyle because I was like, what else? 
and then I thought of finger waves these are so cute like and it matches with like the wavy like water type of vibe you know like wavy water you know yeah you get it you get it. but yeah and one side of the color y'all are gonna be shocked I just said it yeah yeah it's it's gonna turn out really well so if I was you I would stay till the end yes yeah I would <laughs> If any of you guys are wondering what brush I used to do the drawing, not the colouring, I used the Clean Sketch brush which is by Jing Sketch. It's part of the Jing Sketch Basics brush pack. I will link it in the description box below so if any of you guys want to check it out. It is also free by the way, all you need to do is just download it and yeah, and import it to your app or whatever. And yeah. The brushes in that pack are crazy good, like really, really good. But the clean sketch is the one that I use like 99.9% .9 of the time. I'm literally using that brush. So yeah. Um, this was the coloring process now, and yeah, as you can see, I was doing the skin tone and everything like that. And there is a skin tone palette that I use. It's by Radiance on youtube um her art is so amazing i will link her channel and the skin tone palette down below if any of you guys want to check that out yeah i sometimes i understand if some people find it really hard to kind of find reason like actual skin tone you know because sometimes it might look unrealistic since you like picked it for yourself but hers comes with like the perfect um what do you call it the perfect consistency if that makes sense um that's not the word to use but you know what yeah you get it um i will link it down below and if you guys want to check that out and also don't be afraid to comment um video suggestions down below i love taking video suggestions from you guys i absolutely love the ideas that you guys come up with sometimes it's crazy but it's actually good ideas so yeah just comment down below and i'll look into doing it okay okay and yeah i was adding the highlights now um I wasn't actually adding the highlights of the whole face. I was adding the highlights of the lips. I don't. I really don't know why I did that, but you know what? We'll just leave it there. Um, and the hi the main highlight came from the left, since it, you you will understand why I put it on the left um later on in the video. But yeah, I'm literally looking at the finished product right now, and I'm honestly I am proud of it because I've never done anything like this before so honestly i'm proud of myself because side profiles are something really hard to do but you know what i think i nailed it period okay i i nailed it yeah i did yeah i did <laughs> uh but yeah it looks good okay um anyways the video i was doing the shading now as you can probably tell um adding those that shading you know and then the highlights and stuff like that yeah as you can see i was adding the highlights since the sun I told you what <laughs> oh my gosh i don't know how to um, not say something to you guys specifically so it comes from the left side so i put it on the left side of the face if you get what i mean yeah i think you do yeah um but honestly yeah it did turn out great it turned out good period 
I really like Hehe. <laughs> that is literally my favorite part. Um, I love it so much. And if you guys just want to like do mermaid, like it's not too late. I mean, still May. After all, it's literally the 25th of May. So really, there's still time. Okay, you literally can do it. Okay, I believe in you. And when you do it, tag me in it. Okay, tag me in it. Literally tag me in it. Post it on your Instagram. Okay, okay. Period. Or send it to me via DM if you don't wanna post it. Per, I will hype you up. Okay. Period. <laughs> oh, guys. Anyways to the video i just roll sometimes i feel like i just roll i just roll into a new not a new world but like sometimes like when i'm talking to you guys right it's like like sometimes i just stop talking about the drone and i'm like natty focused this is about the video you know <laughs> yeah tell me why i wanted to make her hair orange i don't know why do that i just felt like it but don't worry i changed it i did i did honestly i did but yeah i just roll into my like own world where i'm just talking to you guys like girl they came here for the video yeah 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 <laughs> not to speak to you um but yeah me and you are family like that okay okay period <laughs> but yeah as you can see i changed it to blue I feel like the blue really complements his skin tone a lot, and it's so cute. Okay, really cute. I love it. I absolutely love it. Ryan Little. <laughs> and I also want to be doing more art challenges, just to you know, get into the community a little bit because I feel like I kind of shy away from those kind of stuff, and I also don't know, like. I think I need to just do my research on like art challenges because I know like draw this in your styles and stuff like that but it's like actual challenges like the monthly ones um I think there's not one every month but almost every month but like mermaid you know I'm very proud of myself for hopping onto the challenge because well as you probably can tell I um or yeah i am not very comfortable with drawing side profiles but i was like what get out of your comfort zone let's do this okay and you guys are obviously going to be here with me to experience this moment um and i'm going to look at it in like one week time and i'm going to perfect it <laughs> i'm kidding i'm kidding i'm not i'm kidding um but uh yeah overall i love her face <laughs> oh, i literally love her face she's so cute so pretty and obviously um i had to add a very bright color to complement her skin tone <laughs> okay um but yeah i really love the orange color it's so beautiful And as you guys can probably tell, um, like in my drawings, I don't really implement bra oh, backgrounds. Um, you know, um, again, I feel like I shy away from backgrounds because, like, for backgrounds, you have to add a lot of detail. You have to, you know, actually, if you want to add a background, girl, you have to make sure it looks nice, okay? But you know what? I think. In my drawing where I did um, a girl in a cafe, which was my art progress video, I think it was. So if you want to check that out, I'm going to link it in the description box below and then I'm going to put an icon for it. Um, I think that video was so cute. I think... I think the background was so cute because I did the cafe, but I kind of blurred the background, but I still did a background and it was pretty. Yeah, I really liked it and I was really proud of myself. So now I'm like, you know what? 
<sighs> I think I'm just gonna, you know, do backgrounds a bit more. Um, in this one, I didn't do much of a background. I just did a sunset and like some trees. Um, if you look at Christina's one, hers has trees as well. Not palm trees, yeah, palm trees. But it's like a bit different to mine. Not entirely different, but it's a bit different. Like hers is very much detailed you know no mine is a bit detailed but i went on the more simple side you know but it still looks cute okay but yeah you guys are gonna be seeing more of me drawing some backgrounds um because no we have no time to be shying away from stuff okay we're here to explore we're here to do this together you know so you guys are gonna go on the journey i guess with me okay you're gonna experience this with me um we're gonna learn together um to you know do them okay period as i and also guys i just remembered like um i remember watching this movie called h2o <laughs> Oh, uh, it's, uh, it's on Netflix, if I'm not mistaken. It's really good. Oh, I love that show. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, yeah, it like involves mermaids and stuff, and there's other three girls. Oh, it's really, it's really a good. Um, it's a movie, if I'm not mistaken. I mean, yeah, it's a movie, but I think there's a show. I don't know, but I've watched the movie though. Really good. I love it so much. Um yeah it's just a overall really good movie i could actually use the characters for reference but i did not do that because i just remembered so yeah i can't do that anymore and um towards the end i actually added a little more detail to the drawing because i felt like it was too simple um not too simple but you know too simple so i just added just a little bit of more stuff you know but yeah and stuff like that as you can see i kind of had a smudge there so then i was like using the um eyedropper tool and then removing it and stuff like that so yeah this was just me cleaning up the overall picture um and just making sure it's sparkling um and then i it was time to do the sunset um for the sunset it was really easy i just used a bunch of orange shades and line them up and then use the cushion blur tool and yeah the sunset was really easy i didn't expect it to be that easy but you know what yeah um and then um it was time to do the palm trees i found them a bit hard but not that hard but i just wanted to add them since christina added them so you know i wanted to add that vibe because it doesn't really look like a drawing but obviously it was inspired so i had to add something that looks like hers a little bit okay um and then i decided to add like the actual sunset it's, it's like a sunset so yeah and i kind of made it like glow which i think was so cute yeah it was really cute you'll see you'll see what i mean i'll kind of duplicate it and then um wait i think i'll do it now not now okay now yeah and then i'll use that layer 52 and then i'll blow it yeah um, I think it looks really cool. Oh, I love it, guys. Comment down below what you think of the end result. This is not the end result, by the way. But comment down below what you think of it when you see it. Um, here, I was just adding the shadows to make the sand look a bit more realistic. I mean, it does look like sand. But you know what? We just... You know, you know I literally love adding detail. So, it's like, in everything that I do, I always want to add more detail. Like, after... Like, the... the the thi oh, right <laughs> the picture that i thought was the final product of this um art piece type of thingy wasn't actually the final product because then after that i went in and did some changes because detail 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 yeah <laughs> oh, i'm funny well at least i think i am Uh, 
and also guys overall i really liked this um piece um also again this video was inspired by christiana lamore she is literally the best person on that she's so sweet as well um yeah um anyway guys how y'all day going like purr <laughs> I don't know why I like saying that. I just, it's just the thing that I say. Okay. Yeah. It's just the thing that I say. You're um just gonna get gonna have to get used to it because I literally say it all the time. So yeah. My voice is getting a bit deep, but I think it's because it's nighttime. My voice gets really deep at nighttime and then like gets really deep like early morning. Late night it gets deep and then early morning it gets deep so yeah that's why i'm speaking like this and it's because when i speak to you guys i speak in like my calm voice which is like kind of my normal voice but also not um because most of the time i'm excited for something like right now i'm excited for something that's gonna come up <laughs> see my voice just squeaked then you know it's just something that automatically happens and i don't know why but it just happens but you know what it is what it is <laughs> Anyway guys, I really enjoyed making this video for you guys, really enjoyed spending time with you guys. Thank you for watching this video and if you enjoyed this video too, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, okay? Period. <laughs> and also don't forget to comment your favourite part of it. My favourite part personally was the hair. Also don't forget to follow my Instagram, I'll put it on the iCard, I'll link it in the description box below. I will link everything I mentioned in this video in the description box below if you want to check any of those stuff out. I love you, bye! They call me Mr. Tips. Excuse me, my name.